The Importance of Taking Care of Your Skin When most people think of anti-aging, most of the time what they really want is to make sure that their skin does not show the typical wear and tear that naturally comes with growing older. Over time, we often develop habits that make our bodies suffer, and eventually we begin to see the results of these poor choices. Fortunately, there are many ways that we can begin to address the bad habits that can cause our skin to look more aged than we are comfortable with. This training will cover these anti-aging hacks in the videos to come. The first and foremost of these tips, however, is to do everything possible to take care of your skin and keep it hydrated. If you are not using a good skincare regime now, then it is something to seriously consider for the future. Our skin is what shows the appearance of age, probably more than most other things besides perhaps gray hair. If you want to have the appearance of youth, what you do and don't do for your skin will really make a difference. Everything that we do has a consequence. If we aren't taking care of our bodies to the best possible extent, then ultimately, there will be consequences for that. Make sure the consequences that you manifest are the most positive possible. Our skin is made up of three very important layers. The external layer is called the epidermis and contains the protein keratin, which is what eventually continues to grow as our skin cells die and are removed in flakes. It also contains Langerhans cells, which are a preventative measure our bodies take to ward away bacteria and viruses, along with other things that could ultimately end up making us sick. Our skin insulates us, protects us from water and intense temperatures, and keeps our inner workings safe from sun damage. It also gives the brain signals through our nerve endings when everything is operating fully. Ultimately, it is one of the most important organs in our body, although it can be easily argued that every organ in our body is pretty important. The layer of skin below the epidermis is called the dermis, and it is also very important. It is more to do with the way things work beneath the surface, such as with the temperature regulation by controlling our blood flow. For example, when it's cold outside, our skin will constrict the flow of our blood, while when it is hot, it actually allows the blood to circulate more quickly so that heat can escape through the surface of our skin. Our bodies can cool themselves using natural thermodynamic methods, including sweating. However, when we sweat, it releases toxins from our bodies that can stay trapped on the skin unless we deal with them quickly. That is why it is so important to keep our skin clean, especially if we want to reduce signs of aging. Knowing the importance of our skin and how it works can be a vital element in preventing aging from showing up on it. When we understand just how important skin care really is in our daily regimen and caring for our bodies in general to help us get ahead of aging before it's too late, then we will have the tools at our disposal to live a life with the vitality of youth and the confidence to match it. This training will show you how.